heard about that. There wasn't anything really going on. And then now when I'm here, there's you hear a lot more about it. About I've learned more about their culture from assemblies. They have a hot news council now that they didn't used to have when I was a freshman. And they have a drum group, which is really cool. Um, well, with the program, I think it's more the population grew and it's like changing. And I noticed that there's more Native American students getting involved, being that there's a lot of, there's more extracurricular activities that the Native American program provides. A lot has changed with the Native American students. I feel they're getting more involved. They feel more encouraged by this, the liaisons in the snack office and other liaisons on campus. They feel more involved to get into sports and after school activities. They join more clubs. There's a lot more <clears throat> Native American run clubs, like they have the drum group, the Han Youth Council, and then tutoring after school for Native Americans. Because it's pretty cool to see, I guess, the drum group out, like singing outside for lunch and you can hear them. And like they're all run by students and more people are on, like are involved this year. What I've seen has changed is that Native Americans and academically have been improving in their grades from B's to A's, from C's to B's. And I'm proud of that and now that there's this building of the 900 with the Han Youth Council. They have computers and three advisors, Laurie, Curtis, and Prince, to help them with homework and different activities within their life so they can have better grades and better opportunities to improve their chances of graduating. Mm, I think the 900C benefits me and a lot of other students by um, keeping up our grades and having uh, the liaisons check on us and actually care about um, where we want to go in the future. And I, I believe that that helps us a lot and it encourages, encourages us more to strive to be better. I reflect back to a couple years ago, even three years or even four years ago when I first started, is uh, there's been a, a culture shift in terms of um, our Native American students uh, being involved uh, here on this campus. When I, when I first came here, I, I, there seemed to be a big uh, uh, divide on our campus in terms of uh, our Native American students and non-Native American students. Uh, whenever we've had conversations, we've always spoke about how important it is that our Native American students feel that uh, they have a place on our campus and that their culture is valued. And specifically in the last two years, and, and even more so this year, uh, our Han Council, uh, the, the programs that, that are initiated by our Native American students and uh, by our Native American liaisons, uh, specifically Laura Lai Chavez, uh, have had a direct impact, I think, on uh, how our students view themselves on campus and how they have become more involved. Uh, the difference is clear. I, I almost wish we could see it before and, and after because um, and I still think there's work to be done, but the, the needle is moving in the direction of our students feeling proud of who they are and uh, sharing that culture, not only amongst themselves, but with the other student uh, body in our population here at Brennan High School. Uh, it's amazing. Uh, after school, you could hear our drum group. Uh, you could see uh, the empowerment that our Han Council has when it comes to making decisions. Um, we'll be having our uh, Mr. and Ms. Uh, Native uh, BHS happening uh, this weekend. It's just great to see our students involved, and uh, I expect them to be more involved. Uh, the culture shift has been amazing, and I expect to see uh, greater things happening in the years to come and the months to come. Um, so I give a lot of uh, credit to our, our Native American students for stepping up and, uh, and, and uh, taking ownership in what they're doing and being prideful with their culture. Um, and I also give a lot of credit to our non-Native American students for embracing uh, the diversity that we have on our campus. Uh, Bruno High School is unique in the fact that uh, we are, in my opinion, one of the most diverse uh, schools that, around, even though there's uh, typically our Hispanic and, and Native American, but within our Native American population, there's so many different, uh, uh, different Pueblos that are represented that makes it diverse. Uh, so Berlin High School is a unique place to be, and in, over the past two years, we've seen more and more our Native American students uh, take ownership, step up, and become more involved. And I also want to give credit to our, our liaisons as well, Lorelei, uh, Prince, and uh, Curtis Chavez as well. These programs can't succeed without leadership. And uh, everybody here at Brillo High School, from administration to our teachers to our liaisons are committed to that. Uh, so we're excited to see great things to come and the exciting things that are happening now.